The first data source you add usually just pops into the report layout with randomly selected fields. I'm going to delete it for now and just take a look at the user interface. First, I'll give the report a proper name so I can find it with this name later on. For example, if it is a client report, add the client name and the core idea of the report. I'm going to call my report Looker Studio Training. There is a main menu under the report's name. From here, you can add elements, manage pages of the report, and arrange the elements on the page, among other things. There is another menu ribbon right below the top menu. Let's take a closer look at it. You can add elements to your report by clicking Add a Chart. There are multiple chart options available from the drop-down. Filters and controls are added from the Add a Control drop-down. You can also add images and shapes and access theme and layout from this upper menu part. Let's add a couple of elements to our dashboard. I'll add a scorecard, a time series graph, a bar chart, and a table. 